They're winning 2 0. It's going to be search and destroy next. Oh, anything can happen. This could be a huge comeback now for Infused. Yeah, as I, as I was saying when I was on the stream before, I mean, you never count a team out. I mean, no. MX for two maps down to I can't remember. I think it was Enigma. Yep. And then bang bang, two maps back. He pulled so. it back. But search and destroy is going to be the next game type. We're going to try and get oh. clarification on the map. And I hope all of you guys at home are excited as I am right now. I mean, we've got to say in the Imperial team, Madcat and Josh are standing out. They're doing absolutely amazing. Madcat. I said, it's just, I mean, you look at the players and you think, oh, Mark is the probably standout player in that team. Yeah. But he's playing as well as everyone else. Madcat and Josh are pulling their weight about, which they should be. I mean, Mom was doing quite well as well. He's, he's playing, they're, he's play, playing well, he's, they're playing doing well. their jobs <laughs> and that's, that's the main thing and we are going to search and destroy a launch I can see it from my screen where I am so uh, we're having a look at the lineups there I mean seed first seed ninth you tell me what's going on I'm speechless I'm actually a little bit speechless at this I wish you'd be speechless all the time. I mean, Fnatic, I? MS, excellency like we're saying how, how yeah. many how many lands second at COD XP taking home uh, $200,000 between four people he finished first at ECL Loughborough. His team came fourth at ECL 2. I mean, and then you got Gunchy. I mean, when, when, when has he lost the Cod Land? <laughs> <laughs> when has he lost that land? Yep. Last time he lost was against MX back at ECL 2 when they went on to win it. Yep. So, I mean, we got the bar. We're on yeah, the actually, in reality, he has actually not done, he hasn't done. Bro, oh, we're going to hear Tech Man going a bit insane here, but we'll get back onto the game, and oh. Flux has just killed himself. This, this is just not going well for Infused. I mean, you can look at him, he's hanging his head, he's just... Uh, and, th you know, this is a good thing for Imperial 2. Infused are, are getting frustrated, and Im Imperial are getting happy. This is exactly what they need. Oh, I thought there was going to be a bit of a turn on. Two versus two now. We can see Gunchy is there. Push around behind them on SD. Obviously, they can't hear us from where we are. So we can commentate fully on what's going on in SD at the moment. Yep. We can see Gunchy is pushing around the back of the spawn. He really needs to help. Um, I think it's Nick Excellence uh, who is left alive. I could be wrong. I can't really see what's going on, as I'll be able to tell you. It is Excellence who left. They're against. Uh, if we can bring up the scoreboard just very quickly. Yeah, thank no, you very much. Momo is left 1v2 and is taken out very quickly by Gunchy. Gunchy and Nick getting two kills between themselves. I mean, they're pulling their weight about. Jake and Flux are really need to pick the games up. I mean, it was really good play from the duo who have played together for a long, long time now. Um, Gunchy was just supporting Excellency, the objective player for the team, and he was probably going to manoeuvre, uh, try and get a bomb plant on B. And Gunchy was in a really good position to defend that. 1-0-2 Infuse will we'll stick with them again for the next round. And as per usual, we're going to do uh, batches of two per team. Yeah, we'll stick on board with uh, Infuse for this defensive round. We'll see where Gunshi goes. Uh, and this, I think uh, I'm expecting a bit of an uh, aggressive push, but well, that's what I would normally think for Infuse. But they're 2-0 down against the period 2 in the quarterfinals of EGL London. I mean, by any means... Because Infuse to be in, uh, say Infuse do lose this game, mm -hmm. there is no chance that they will not finish outside the top four. Yeah, they, they'll fight their way through that losers bracket. Although even if Imperial Four do win this, I feel it is all about tomorrow. As more and more picks up a kill on Kunshi, and we can hear Josh with his uh, trademark banner. Oh, and that is three down. <laughs> Infuse are, are not looking good in this round. They did win the first round, of course. Jake is the last one alive against four, I think. Yep, it is Jake against the remainder of Imperial 2. He's got to defend the bombs as well, which is going to be difficult for him. There is only 30 seconds left, though. The bomb has gone down. It's not looking good for Jake. And I'd imagine this is going to be tied up at 1-1 in the third map. As he... Oh, oh, oh dear. Josh, I know you've been playing well this line, mate, but what was that? And Momo gets off a grenade, and that is 1-1 in this map. Yeah, he made up for the mistake by Josh. 1-1. So far in this search and destroy, it'd be nice to switch over to Imperial if we can get a view from their perspective, and we'll try and get on board with them as soon as possible. So who do you want to go on board with when we go on to Imperial 2 team? Not that I really need to ask. But. Uh, well, uh, you, you know, I would say Momo, but, uh, well, yeah, he's, he's got the most kills. I always say when we switch over to go to the person who is picking it up the most, and he's, he's got the most kills, I'm, I'm going to say. <laughs> and hopefully... He can perform well in this round whilst we are spectating him. He's opted for the AK. He is a predominantly an SMG player, but... And a bad one. Yep. <laughs> I'm jesting, I'm jesting. He's done better than me than Lamb. 
But uh, no, he is just waiting. It, it, I mean, that, that it's full on sweat at the moment now for Imperial. Would you not be sweating if you two now? I, I, you know, I don't think I would have got to this stage. I'd, I'd have probably been dropping. Oh, Momo! Picking up Gunchy there. That was amazing. We're going to see this shot. <laughs> I'm so, you know, I, I, I'm I mean, trying to commentate, Tony, but I'm so happy. I right mean, by now. any means, it was just a pretty easy kill. <laughs> it's it, it irrelevant. That, that, that was Gunchy just outgunned. Just outgunned Gunchy. <laughs> he wasn't preeminent. It it was, it, it's irrelevant. <laughs> Momo is one of the best players on He's Call the best player I've ever seen. Yeah. Probably one of the I know there's some I've random tape in my photo. I don't know what's going on here. We're just having our photo taken whilst on live stream. I've, I've got I've got a big smile on my face. Picture is anyway, taken. moving on. Too too much. Are we fame. actually doing anything? We're commentating on the stream. We are we are commentating this stream mm -hmm. and we are watching Imperial TMC having an excellent LAN at the moment. They are approaching. Just get the distracted by the commoners of the spectators. Oh. I mean. Anyway, back what to the game. Like? We can see Imperial have pushed onto the air bomb site, and it's wanted. down, and in Flux picking up a big double kill. Mark's going to have to do something special with their Reflex MP5. Yeah, the Reflex ah. MP5, interesting. Interesting. Mm. Uh, we lost that round, but it's not over yet. Get ready for the next one. Switching sides. Okay. Yep, yeah, and uh, just to remind you now, we're just... Uh, speaking to the, the people behind the stream who are telling us, just to remind you guys that we do apologise that you can only hear us from the left uh, the left side of the speakers at the moment. Uh, it's an issue that we're trying to get sorted, but I don't know. Ho hopefully you can hear us okay as we are watching a 2-2 tie at the moment between Imperial and Infused. We are still on board with Imperial. Uh, it would be good to switch over to Infused now following the, our two-round rule. So you can see Gunshi is pushing up the right hand side. They have spotted somebody down the right. There is already 35 seconds gone. Gunshi is not in the best of positions. He should be able oh. to take out TMC. TMC just preems. I mean, <laughs> he does it well. I, I can't complain against him. But excellence does take him out yep. as he did stay in the same position. Jake just takes out Momo, who's in no man's land at the minute, just walks out in the middle of the map. Yep. You can see Jake is going to push towards the B bomb site. Momo was caught off guard a little bit there. He kind of just ran right in front of Jake. Uh, they have got to plant this bomb. Josh picks up a kill. I'm not sure how many are left on Imperial, but there is only one for Infused, and he needs to get the plant. I don't know. I know Josh is alive for Imperial. I, I don't know if he knows that Jake has the bomb with him. If we can get the scoreboard up to see what this is, is it a 1v2? Oh, it's a 1v1. This is big. And this is going to be big for Josh. If he does get this kill, we are going to hear he's a gonna very high pitch scream across the, go <laughs> across the stage. He's going to be aware that he's planting B because the air bomb site was rumbling because of the rocket. Jake does get away. We can't hear the bomb be diffused here. So <laughs> we, we currently have no sound ourselves. We have Pitcher, and Jake is in a very good position. Uh, if, it, you know, Josh would have to be psychic to even know that he was going to be up there. There's only going to have to be a sneaky diffuse here mm -hmm. to get away with it. That's the only thing. I mean, if Josh went for the diffuse now, I don't think Jake would know. I, I don't think Josh is actually going to manage to pull this off. It would be amazing. Of course, he could be diffused now. I don't know. The streamers at home one, though. We have no the idea. The tension is killing me. The, yeah. Um, and that is going to be the round. Yeah. Jake played that really well, actually. Uh, he did well to get that plant. I think Josh must have been lingering around the A-bomb somewhere. So now Infuse taking the lead on this search and destroy. We will see them attempt to defend against the Imperial squad now. Personally, we'll just go for a Chris Turner advice here. Whenever you're one-on-one -on -one in Demolition, the bomb is down. I go straight for the Diffuse. Because they don't expect you to just go whack straight Diffuse. For any people who play Tony in future lands, you you know his strategy now. Uh, ton goose. He's, he's giving it away. I've given, he's, he's I've given the, tra the, trades, <laughs> the trade secrets away. Yeah. That's how you become such a good card gamer. Yeah, well. Nah, I'm good too. <laughs> I've got uh, my scuff controller now, no one, nothing can stop me. Yeah, I know as well, we should mention this again, just a, a thanks to Scuff for, you know, sponsoring this tournament alongside Rockstar, who have been providing us with way too much energy drink. Yeah, I'm no, I week. am never going to sleep tonight, there's <laughs> not a chance. Just approaching us with, with ice cold Rockstar, was oh, very oh, nice oh. Momo. So good Momo. And Josh as well, getting a kill against Flux. I'm busy face palming, just saying. Uh, <laughs> As you can see, Jake is pushing around the back of the spawn. He is the last one alive for Team Infused. As they go against the Imperial 2, it's not looking well. I'm saying it's not looking good. They are two maps down, but they are 3-2 up the in rounds. The bomb does go down on the B-bomb site. I'm not too sure if this is 1v3, 1v4. I don't know if he... If he had a shot to Josh here. No, he's not going to get away with it. Josh's head position. I mean, if you're Jake there, I mean... You're going to be confident in your ability. You're going to outshot B-spot Josh. But, 
this is a big sport, Josh. The infamous for the yellow 90. Oh, I'm missing the yellow 90. That's I genuinely, if they win this game, I'm going to go out and buy one in honor. We should all just turn up and, and yell out. Do apologize. Right, okay. We've just getting the sound audio balanced out for you guys. On board with TMC now, we've switched over to Imperial on the defense. Here yeah, we on, go. on board with TMC at the moment, sitting back of the generator as it be. That's a cheeky little spot that I've used before. Um, where's he gone? All right. Okay, well, it's still on board with TMC, which is a bit boring, if anything. Ainsley, if you can change it up, that would be appreciated. We're on board with Momo, in a very advanced <laughs> position. Ainsley, you god. You're not a big fan of the TMC style of play? No, uh, I, I'm a fan of him. Because uh, he is, he's undoubtedly one of the different players. He is. Yeah. Honestly, I, I, as I was, I was speaking to Mark as we were going to, um, as we were going to McDonald's. Yep. I'm like the, I'm like the West Ham of the, <laughs> of the Call of Duty world. I just, I get these players who are not known whatsoever. Start team with them, and suddenly they're winning lands. I mean, he's not, he's not won land yet. No, not, not just yet. But to Momo now on his own, he's got to get this diffuse as well as the Kelly Sports Excellency. I think, I'm not sure, oh, there is another player left. I'm not actually sure how many are left. He's just going to go straight for this defuse now. Which is the best thing to do on that my attack. Is he going to get away with it? No, and that is a big shame. That would have been so, so good if he could have pulled that off. Jay Duke making the right decision there, though. And you can see he was hesitating a little bit. And I thought he was going to choke the shooting at one point. Yeah, he did the right thing. He just got a few bullets off on Momo to see where he was. So um, he, he, he ended up doing the right thing. He didn't necessarily choke, but um, yep, that is four three to infuse. Yep, they are now taking the lead, but this is still a very very close search and destroy game. We're just gonna get off the creator class and uh, we're gonna watch TMC for a little bit. We we give him a bit of stick for his his uh, defensive style of play, shall we say? But you know he's picking up kills. He he went over triple positive, I believe, when he was playing ruthless. Yeah, I mean. The, I think the ruthless game has just like sort of pushed them onwards. They the followed that momentum they got from. I mean, they walked over. Mm. They walked over around this. What was that? Was? No, that's the only. Um, <laughs> yeah. It's kind of ruthless. Yeah. Uh, they just walked all over them. The momentum seems to be just carrying them through. I mean, they're one round down on this map. Yep. But yeah. the two maps up. Yep, that is correct, and it looks like Infused are going to get the better of them this round, and it may go to 5-3. There we go. Just to remind all of you guys at home that are just joining us, uh, we are still having these technical difficulties, and we're going to try and speak a little bit louder for you guys just to make things clearer, as you can only hear us through one speaker at the moment. 5-3 to Infuse, Tony. It looks like they are going to take this search and destroy game. We'll switch over onto the other team now and see... What is going to happen if they can seal the deal now? Me and Tony getting our picture taken again just by the admiring Hi, foreign girl. Love you, Shannon. Uh, <laughs> and see, yeah. We are commentating the infused Imperial.2 game here. <laughs> uh, hello, Mrs. Tig. Mrs. Tig, admiring me and myself and Tony. Why wouldn't you be admiring me? <laughs> anyway, now okay, we can see we're on board with Gunshi at the moment. Let's see what he can do with this MP5. They are 5 3 up in this map, and he gets a bit unlucky against Mark. Getting very excited with this room here. There's a few oh, different Mark. games going around with Mark picking up a brilliant kill on Jake. Mark's having a blinder in event. I mean, he comes to him. Josh. <laughs> Josh again. It looks like it's going to go to 5 4. Excellent. Excellence is not going to challenge that. He is in a 1v4 situation. He can't really do much about. Yeah, uh, he's slowly he's running stuck. out of time as well. Yeah, he's stuck. He is stuck in his own spawn. They know where he is, and I would be surprised if Imperial 2 try and challenge it, but Josh, no fear. I'd like to bring up the scoreboard at this stage and just get a little bit of an update of how each player is performing. We can see Momo on top, not getting the most kills, though. Josh and Mark picking it up really well. All of the Imperial team are positive, apart from TMC falling slightly behind. Good. Gunch is bottom. She's at the bottom. Uh, is this is, is this happening? Or? Yeah, I mean Imperial two are beating them two 0 and Gunji's bomb. Yeah, I mean Infused <laughs> are, are, are looking like they, they will probably win this search and destroy. Imperial are going to have to have won three games in a row to actually seal the deal here. They have managed to win one, but two more left to go. Yeah, when see Gunji's taking a bit of a defensive role, obviously playing the S and D, you are primarily playing defensively, but he's, he seems to be sitting quite far back. He's just covering the middle. 
Uh, he'll obviously watch for the shadow coming through in the middle of there. That's a bit of a sweaty tactic from me. I mean, honestly, I'm just going to tell people how to play this game. <laughs> uh, yeah. We're on board with Gunji. Chuck his flash in the mid map. Try and get a hit marker to find out where somebody is as Flux takes out Josh on the right hand side. Ramp towards A. Yeah, not many kills are going down, and that is bad news for the attacking side, which is Imperial. They have just lost one of their players. Ooh. Mark getting a good kill against Gunji, though, now. There are other people playing in this room who are having having a great time, it would seem, as well, Tony. Oh, it was tech, man, I mean. But I, I, I'm pretty sure the whole Call of Duty audience now is sur surrounding the station. It isn't. Actually, I think it's a 3v2 situation in favour of Imperial. Mm. They could bring this back. I mean... Yeah, okay. Well, you're looking at 15 seconds to go. They really need to get a plum, bomb plant down. That's Flux takes out Mark. It's a 2v2 situation. Oh. TMC does take out. Oh. oh, that's 5-5. Five, five. Oh, We're going the last We're round. Gone. Oh. We are in the last round. This is this could be it. Imperial.2 could shut out Infuse, the number one seed, the all-star lineup. 3-0. Three three nil. Nil. Let us be serial for one second, Tony. Is this real life? I, I'm not sure if this is authentic I don't, existence. Real life, the, I is this it? I don't, I, I don't even know what I'm watching. Nick Ward doesn't look very happy. Nick Ward is not happy. The, the half Brazilian, half Scotsman. Yeah. Is that right? Well, he, he claims he's Brazilian. He's, Pr he's, he's proud really. of his Brazilian heritage. Mark picks up the first kill. This, this going to be good. Oh. <laughs> this going to be good. Well, it's not over yet, but it is three versus four in favour of Imperial.2. How nervous are you if you're infused? How nervous are you if you're I, Imperial? I, I, I'm, I'm struggling to even watch this right now. You're so nervous for your brother. How are you even commenting? I love him. It's the it's the bromance. It's literal bromance. Because you are brothers. Yeah, so, uh, but, uh, there we go. Yeah. Three versus three. Although if you were having a romance, I might have to call the police. It's a bit weird. Oh, Gunchy's turned on Mark. That was oh. big. That was a no, no, amazing Mark. turn. Momo picks up the kill against Flux. Two and versus Gunchy two. Hasn't seen TMC. Is... There is a one v two situation going on. Excellency, one versus two to win this search and destroy. If he goes down. Imperial.2 will have shut out Infused 3 nil. Oh my god. He's got to get the bomb plant as well. And he's running out of time. He's running out of time, mate. He has nothing to do. Oh, they just beat them 3 nil. They've just beat them 3 nil. In Imperial.2 have just shut out the number one seat of EGL. The, the camera is spinning around. We're just going to get a shot of this. You want to see my face, mate? I, I, they are shaking hands. Shits weren't given. I don't care. The number one team of EGL4. The all-star lineup, the the achievements within that team against Imperial Dot Two, three 0 win. This, would, is it fair to say these are the surprise team of the land? My face isn't real life, though. I, I don't even want to turn the camera out and look at what. I don't like, even. I, I we need to get a shot of us. E emo's just emo's what? Uh, we need to get a shot of us. Yeah, interview, interview. Wait, we, we just got. Bring well, them over. Bring I don't them even know. Over. Phil. I don't even know what I have just witnessed. No, go Wait. by the camera. Go by the camera. Bring that camera up now. I don't even. I don't even know what I've just witnessed. We're, we're done. We're done. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. Infused. Oh. Inf <laughs> infused. <laughs> Imperial dot two. I've just beat Infused three nil. They are in the winner bracket. <laughs> winner bracket semi final. Try and get the interview, uh, Try, try and, try and get the. In some of you from try and get Mark to come over here. Yeah, we're trying to get an interview with uh, some of the Imperial players. I mean, I don't know who's watching the stream at home. This has actually happened. Uh, We've even got foreign girls showing some love to the Imperial team right now. <laughs> Mark's got a big smile on his face. <laughs> <laughs>